Hello guys, Matt from 123MyOT here, and in this video we will show you how to transfer data from Android to Android in 2022. Okay guys, if you are transferring data from any Android device to Samsung, then you will be able to transfer calls, contacts, messages, apps, home screen, settings, photos, videos, music and documents. If you are transferring from Samsung to other devices, then you will be able to transfer contacts, calendars, photos and videos. Guys, just a few tips before you start. Turn off any security features such as passcodes as they might interrupt the transfer process. Delete any unwanted video and picture files. This is to save transfer time and also space on your new phone. And if you have a SIM card, you can transfer it at any time. Today we are going to transfer data from a Samsung S21 to a Samsung S22 phone and we are going to use an app called SmartSwitch. Smart Switch will work with most Android phones. However, if it doesn't, fast forward to the 5 minute 07 mark and I will show you a different app to use if Smart Switch does not work for you. Most Samsung phones will have the Smart Switch app already installed under Settings, Accounts and Backup. But if you can't find it on your device, you can download it from the Google Play Store. Tap agree and then join your phone to the same Wi-Fi as your old phone. Actually I'll put it on my 5G Wi-Fi because it's a little bit faster. Okay, Smart Switch should start to download. To check its progress, just swipe down from the top. Okay, while that's downloading, go back to your old phone and tap on send data, and then tap on wireless. Now that it's downloaded, go back to the Smart Switch app, and then tap continue, and then allow. Next, tap receive data, and then tap Android, and then wireless. Go ahead and tap connect on your old phone, and if you get the error could not connect, don't worry. Just hit connect again on both phones. It should come up straight away the second time around. Tap allow on your old Android phone and it should start the transfer process. Your Android phone should then work out what data it can copy across. Go ahead and choose what data you want to copy across and then deselect anything you don't want to copy across. If you tap on custom and then next, and then swipe up and select everything you want to copy to your new Android phone. When you're done, just tap transfer. Sweet, so your data will copy across now. If you check your time and it's taking ages, you may have too many large video files and slow wireless. Let me know how long you needed to wait in the comments section below. Okay, let us go back to the home screen and we'll check if our data copied across. Okay, let's check in the gallery for our videos and photos. Okay, so no photos yet, where did they go? If you need to check Smart Switch, it's still probably uh, trying to put all the data in the right spot. So we can check that by swiping down at the top. Okay, cool, so it's given us the results of what it has copied across. You can now tap on view more and then next and then done. Awesome, there's our photos in the gallery and all your stuff should be copied across now.
Right, let us transfer the data back the other way now. We are going to use an app called Copy My Data. You can download it from the Google Play Store. I have already downloaded it, so I will just open up the app. Make sure that you have downloaded it on both Android phones. If you get prompted to allow, just tap allow. When you get prompted, tap next on both devices and then also tap to or from another device over Wi-Fi. Go ahead and select your device and then select copy data from selected devices. This is because we are transferring the data back the other way. Add your PIN number and then tap next. Deselect any of the data you don't want to copy across and if you get prompted just tap allow on your other device. Just tap finish on both phones and check if your data is copied across OK. If you have a SIM card you can also move it now. Once your data is copied across, you can go ahead and delete the Copy My Data app. Guys, don't forget to check out my other videos such as Samsung Galaxy S22 unboxing. And do me a favour, if you know anyone who might like this video, please share it with them. Hit the subscribe button and smash the bell icon.